everybody. <laughs> Kathy here with Paint Point by Kathleen Miller. I was acting goofy today. I'm doing, you know, this and that. And Phil's threatening me by she's going, I'm going to put the camera on. Well, I don't care. Go ahead because this is a real me. I'm in a really goofy mood since lunch. Uh, we went out to a new place called the Local Goat. And um, I don't know what they put in my food, but man, I'm in a good mood. And Phil's kind of canoochie, which means crabby. But I'm now he's been in a better mood because I'm acting goofy. But what's new? Oh. So, on with the show. Welcome to our channel, everybody. I'm Kathy with Paint Pouring by Kathleen Miller, and I'm back to my old self now. Kind of like the other person a little bit better, but this is okay. If you are new, welcome. And um, all these but goodies, welcome. So, today I'm going back to my old old roots and I'm doing a caterpillar swipe have not done one in two years maybe maybe even a little bit longer and um they're a lot of fun to do there's a lot of paints that I put on now don't get overwhelmed everybody I might not use all of them but if I do I do so I have my color to go which is uh, extra white actually today extra and that's, white. that's by Sherwin Williams extra white and it is parrot time with Phil no I was going to ask what is the extra what is the extra to the white I mean isn't white just white no a lot of times they have extra white and oh they add a little bit more of an ingredient to make it extra white oh special because see oh, I it's a special. antique white from color place you okay. have Mm -hmm. This is extra white. So look at how white, white it is. Oh, okay. So with that being said, we'll move on. That is my base. There is no water. There is no silicone. And there is no glue in this. So we're going to start out with these colors. I have phthalo green by Amsterdam over here, Phil. Uh, Cadmium red by Liquitec Basics. This is French Lilac by Color Art Primary Elements, Aberdeen Color Art Primary Elements, Amsterdam Sky Blue Light, Metallic Violet by Artist Loft. This is Sapphire on Ice by Primary Elements Color Art. This is Cobalt Turquoise, which is a golden fluid acrylic. This is Rain Bling It. And it's mixed with a light blue by Golden, which is primary elements and mixed in there. Azo Yellow by Amsterdam. This is Mahogany and Chambord together, which is Color Art Pigments. Solar Flare, which is a Bling It by Color Art, which is just oh, beautiful. If you want bling into your paintings, head on over to Color Art and get some of this Solar Flare it. It's beautiful. I have PBO iridescent green yellow. I have golden pyroli orange, ruby red color art primary elements, and my deco art 24 karat gold. So it's an 8 by 16 canvas. We're going to get started. So what I do first with this is I go down the middle with some colors. Um, it's just colors of my choice. It can be your colors of your choice. You don't have to use the exact same colors that I use if you don't like them. You're using, you have a choice of 16 colors on this one Correct. today. Wow. Correct. So let's see. We're just going to go down the middle like this. This is cadmium red. And even the base, uh, a lot of the base will be covered up. So you don't even have to use an extra white or a white or an antique white. You can use any color base that you want. Okay, let me see. What do I want to go down the middle with? Um, Too many choices. I think we're going to go next with the uh, mahogany and the chambord. No, we're not doing that. <laughs> I'm going with the turquoise. I didn't really want red with red. Okay. Now, on top of that one, I'm going to do a little French lilac, a little pinky stinky here, Phil. Okay. And I want to uh, thank everyone that has subscribed to my channel and has tuned in. Uh, 
it's just been a whirlwind. I never, ever thought that I would be hitting almost 50,000 subscribers. Thank you all, Phil and I appreciate every single one of you. And um, we wouldn't be here if it wasn't for you. So I just wanna add that. Thank you, thank you, thank you so very much for supporting our channel. <clears throat> but you know, I know most of you know that I'm thankful for all of you. Okay, I think that's what I'm gonna do just down for the middle. I'm is, not doing any more. Do you think that's enough middle. paint for Donovan? Well, I'll see once I get my dabs on. You know. Okay. My dabs. All right. Okay, so uh, this is the first step of the caterpillar swipe, getting some nice colors uh, down the middle. And then, of course, Kathy is going to start putting some blobs or dabs or whatever you want to call them of different colors down the line on each side. Yeah, it's going to be like a little caterpillar. Hopefully, hopefully this caterpillar will turn into a beautiful butterfly, Phil. Yeah, I'm hoping so, yes. That would be wonderful. Kathy does have a Facebook group called Paint Point by Kathy Miller. You should love to have you join. The cool thing about that is you can post your own creations, which is really neat. Ask questions, make comments. There's lots of wonderful artists out there. There's a direct link in the description box to become a member of Kathy's Facebook group. And as she mentioned, um, her YouTube channel is a basically, and it might be already by the time this is published, at 50,000 subscribers. If you'd like to subscribe, there's also a link in the description box to subscribe to Kathy's YouTube channel. There's over 700 videos out there, along with some specialty videos and some discount codes in the description box. Yeah, I just, I can't believe, I never thought in a thousand years that I would have that many subscribers. Because Phil and I, when, when it was my idea to do a YouTube channel, I, we have a lot of new subscribers that don't really know much about Phil and I, and he retired. So it was like, okay, I have hobbies. Phil had no hobbies. Phil's hobby was work and watching the grass so that it was trimmed properly because he's a <laughs> fanatic with lawns. So, you know, if, if you have a husband that is going to retire and you've been on your own for all this time, it's like, oh my God. Cause I said to him, are you serious? And he goes, yeah. I'm thinking, oh, I'm in trouble. <laughs> so, cause I'm thinking he's going to, he's going to want to, you know, go golfing all the time and, and, I'm not a golfer. You, well, I was, were you worried about I was going to bug you or something? Yes. Oh. Yes. <laughs> because I'm thinking he's he's just going to be on the, because I have my own routine. As women know that they have their own routines. So I came up with the idea of, Phil, let's start a YouTube channel. And he goes, what? I said, yeah, let's start a YouTube channel. I, have, I didn't know anything about YouTube. I've never watched it. And he goes... I don't know how to do that. I said, well, you know what? They have books for dummies and stuff. You could order one. <laughs> Those were perfect for me. Yeah, I mean, it's like you read all these books, order a book for dummies, and let's start a channel. So he goes, well, I don't know. I'll think about it. I'll think about it. Okay. So all of a sudden, one day he comes and he goes, oh, I think we can start a YouTube channel. I was flabbergasted. I just couldn't believe it. I'm thinking... Really? Because I'm thinking, okay, this is the Joker. If you saw our video, I had the Joker, the card, because this is some of the stuff he pulls. Well, needless to say, here we are. And he is my videographer. He's my editor. He's just wonderful to so work I still with. Give you grief. He's wonderful to work with. Well, I, I do enjoy it. I, didn't I do enjoy say, it. I didn't say all the time. But yeah, now he really likes it. So he's really excited. Okay, so we got the first thing on. Now we're going to go back. We're going to do a little dab a do. Little dab a do, Phil. Mm -hmm. I 
and even though there's about 700 and some videos on your YouTube channel, I think we've done over a thousand videos over the years. We don't always put them all on or and some some of the older ones we've taken off. So, so yeah, I mean, we have we have a lot of fun. I don't do as many as I did when I started out with and people, you know, people many videos. Yeah, people go, "Why why aren't you doing all those videos again?" Well, I do have a life, people. <laughs> and I am retired. Oh jeez, you're retired. Yes, you are. So I figured, you know, as long as I just keep doing them, I'm happy because I, I love painting. It's one of my favorite things to do. It's very uh, calming to me. I'm, like I always tell everybody, it's only paint. Don't let the paint get to you. It's only paint. Well, you as I've mentioned um you know, over the course of these videos, every once in a while, I've mentioned that Kathy's been an artist for over 30 years, and uh, Poor Painting is one of her latest endeavors. But just to kind of show you, Kathy also has done a lot in silver. That's one of her bracelets that she's created in silver. She's done that uh, over the years also. Yeah, and I'm triple certified in that. And, uh, and also, it's a lot I don't know if it's kind of dark, but... Kathy has designed necklaces. Her, this is her one of her necklaces from her glass series and so forth. So, she's done a lot of different things over the years, and this is her latest. Yeah, endeavor. I'm just, I'm just not an artist. I just. We're well, not a painting artist, right? Yeah. And I mean, you've done other types of painting in the past too. Exactly. I just, I love all different types of stuff. My abstract paintings, my love paintings. I mean. I love everything about painting. Okay. As you can see, Kathy's putting some different complementary colors in the blobs that she's put down. Creating the caterpillar, even though caterpillars don't have legs. <laughs> We're making them have legs. That's right. Oh. oh no, 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 no. I gotta put that uh, solar flare on a couple more. I want some more, a little bit blingy. Mm -hmm. Did I get them all? My baby girl is wanting to play so bad with her ball. She keeps dropping it up here. Now she's bringing it up here in her mouth. Because she wants to play. So as soon as we're done here, we have to go and play. And we throw like about oh, 25 different babies of hers. Those are her toys. And uh, she just has a ball. But she can be very pesty. She's very... She's very patient. She will just sit there and stare at you until you get up and start throwing her toys. Babies, as I call them. And if we're lucky, Phil will get up and maybe throw a couple when he's not on his word game. So like I said, everybody, give this a little try. Because it's a lot of fun, even though there is... You've got a few splitches going there. Doesn't matter. Oh, doesn't? Okay. No. Doesn't matter, Phil. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Okay. You're topping it off with what color? Uh, this is ruby red. Okay. Not much. Just a dab. So head on over to uh, my Facebook group and uh, pop, you know, put some of your creations on there. 
I'd love to see what everybody's making. There's a lot of, like Phil said, great artists. And uh, share it with your friends. Have them join. Um, have them sign up on my YouTube channel. And hopefully I can teach you a few nice things to make. You, yeah, yes, you can learn a lot of new techniques and we'll by just watching have fun. the videos on there, yes. Okay, so now we're on to the cell activator, which is oxide black and Australian Floetrol. And we're going to do a little swipey dipey on this uh, caterpillar. See what we got here, Phil. It's always interesting to see what... Uh, Comes up. Starts, yes. <laughs> I always like to cover up most of the palette knife. And yes, I did have a question. Yes, Something is hanging from the back of it. Your cell activator is the thinnest out of all of the paints and pigments and everything. Okay. Oh, well, I might as well just get down and dirty, Phil. Okay. Okay, we're gonna go this way. By the way, all these paints that Kathy is using um, have the same recipe, same pouring medium recipe. That's in video 478. There's a direct link to that recipe video in the description box. It'll also give you that simple recipe for her Cell activator. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, you never know what you're going to get here until you start swiping. Oh, well, you're getting like some a nice box cells. Of chocolates. The object of the caterpillar swipe is to get a variety of colors around or by the side of the central swipe. So hey everybody, um, head on over to my Etsy shop. I have some new creations of boots in there and we now have some sneakers and those are pretty darn cool. And if you need any supplies, head on over to my Amazon shop. Um, it's all listed in there. My Every single thing I use is in my Amazon shop. So feel free to go over there as well. Okay, how am I gonna do this, Phil? Do I wanna go down? Yeah, why not? Yeah, there are direct links again in the description box to get to both Kathy's Amazon shop and her Etsy shop. Oh, I can't leave these little hummers. <laughs> Cute little things. We got some real cool areas with different colorations oh, no. popping up. And that's exactly what you want from the Caterpillar Swipe. Really cool area there. Okay. A little dabble, do you? Yes. And these I'm going to leave. Yeah, that's fine. Did you end up using all 16 colors? I did. Wow. I did. I believe I did. Okay. Yes, I did. I did, I did, I did, Phil. <laughs> okay.
I did, I did, I did. That's a sparkle there. Didn't want all that black. You know what I mean? Because this will spin off, but I just yeah. don't want all that black. All right. You just dab it off with your finger, huh? Mm-hmm. This might be kind of cool, actually. Yeah. Okay, there's beautiful cells in there. Beautiful cells. I'm gonna enhance this a little and see what we get. Yeah. We're gonna see if we can turn it into a beautiful, beautiful creation. So, here we go, everybody. That's it. Wow. Okay, really, now we're really gonna spin cool. this and see what happens. Start out slow and progressively go a little bit faster. If you need to. Right. I just want to do one more. Wow. Oh, is this pretty? Wow. This Isn't is really pretty. Always first. Very cool. Look at all the super colors all over. That's what the caterpillar swipe will do for you. It's really, really, really pretty. Neat area. It's gorgeous. The, the spinning expands the size of the cells and also expands the enhancing lines, as you can see there. It's Got really, a really pretty. cool area there. Just so much color. There's so much bling in it. Oh my goodness. It's so blingy. It's beautiful. That solar flare will really, really bring up the uh, bling in it. Right. So everybody, if you like this caterpillar swipe, uh, do it and show me some pictures in uh, the Paint Pouring by Kathleen Miller group. Uh, I'd love to see it. And uh, share this with your friends. Please subscribe to our channel if you haven't subscribed. And uh, I'll see you all later, alligators. Bye. we got to take a, a view up through this. It's so cool, all the different areas. We're doing the tour. The tour. The tour up through it. Wow. Let me just see it to the sideways again.